Today, I'm gonna to show you how to make the easiest slow cooker chicken tacos with a secret ingredient hidden inside. I'm using boneless, skinless chicken breasts in this recipe, which can have a tendency to dry out if you cook them too long or at too high of a heat in the slow cooker. So today, I'm borrowing an idea that I got from using my Instant Pot so much, and what I learned with that is if you lift the chicken breast up away from the bottom of the pot, the chicken stays juicier and more tender without overcooking. Instead of asking you to buy some special equipment for this, we're going to use a layer of shredded cabbage on the bottom of your slow cooker, which will lift the chicken up away from the bottom of the pot, keeping it juicier. And it's also going to add more nutrients into your meal. I hope you'll just trust me on this one and give it a try. To get started, you'll grease the bottom of your slow cooker with one tablespoon of olive oil, then add the shredded cabbage on the bottom. I'm using a bag of pre-shredded cabbage that weighs 10 ounces, but you can use as little as eight ounces or as much as 12 ounces without really noticing the cabbage in this recipe. Now we're going to mix together the homemade taco seasoning. Combine a half teaspoon of smoked paprika, two teaspoons of ground cumin, one teaspoon of chili powder, and one and a half teaspoons of salt. I'm going to add the boneless, skinless chicken breasts on top of that cabbage. And I'm using about one and a half pounds here. And then I'm going to drizzle a tablespoon of fresh lime juice over the top. Season with half of the taco seasoning that you just made. Now you're gonna flip the chicken breasts over and it's okay if some of the cabbage sticks to it because you want the cabbage to get seasoned with this taco mix too. And we're gonna season the other side. And if you have some extra taco seasoning in the bowl, just sprinkle it over the cabbage that's in there because we want all of it to get seasoned. I'm also gonna sprinkle some freshly minced garlic over the top for extra flavor. Now all I have to do is add the lid and cook it on low heat for three to four hours. Now you always want to cook boneless, skinless chicken breasts on low in the slow cooker, and they should be done in about three hours, but you can cook them up to four hours if you need to based on your schedule. Usually three hours is more than enough time for the breasts to reach an internal temperature of 165 degrees Fahrenheit, but I always like to double check that with a meat thermometer. When the chicken is cooked, use two forks to shred it and mix it in with the cabbage, which should be very tender. Serve the taco filling in your favorite taco shell, or use a lettuce leaf as a grain-free and low-carb option. Pile them up with your favorite toppings and dig in. I hope this recipe will come in handy when you need a busy weeknight dinner, and you can always find the printable version over on my website, detoxinista.com. If you enjoy these kind of videos, be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel and check out my other videos if you need more quick and easy whole food recipes.